Paris, Manchester United pulling off. Uh, it was 10 injuries. When I saw some of the players, like, there was one you who looked 12. I was like, there's the picture made up. Like, how did he get on the pitch and stay there? Do you know what I mean? I don't even know what his name was, but this kid looked young. And he'd gone there and they beat him. Paris Saint Germain 3 1. How does that happen? I'm going to go on a rant, so do you want to go first or that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 I got the soul shine, I said, there's something crazy going on behind the scenes, but it was literally. Watch the throne, Jay Z and Kanye West track for it. That's exactly what it was. Um, but I, it didn't make sense because everything just, <laughs> everything just went for Manchester United. Yeah. And it has been. It's, it's been going for United. Like, in a Liverpool game, how many players came off injured yeah. couldn't do nothing to them? Mm. Like, any other team would have just ripped to shred, not United. Like a force field is around oh, them. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, Juju? Granted, yeah, but granted, they lost the first thing. So, after the first thing, I'm thinking, two away goals to PSG. Yes, they bottled it in the last 16, but surely. But, surely. but we're idiots, though. Because think about it. They had a 4 0 lead against Barcelona, yeah. scored an away goal, and still went out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and not too long ago, they also had a 3 1 lead against Chelsea. And, and still went out. Well. And I think Chelsea, but Chelsea, no, they went out to 10 men in that yeah. game. But even still. Yeah, but this man, United team was enough like that. Barca no. team, though, man, do you know? But the Chelsea know. team weren't great. Fred, Pereira, <laughs> McTominay. That's a poor piece of terrible. I'll be real with you. And this is the thing as well. I, I need Man United fans right now to not tell me I'm hating. This is the one thing I hate. Like, obviously, a lot of the time I'm just doing things to get under the skin, but we're analysts. This is what we're here to do. Mm. So I'm just being real. So this is not hate, this is just real. What happened was ridiculous, but PSG did it to themselves. Man, you should be happy they're through. Don't act like you smacked it and you like. Because a lot of Man fans are getting a bit carried away and acting like, like they really had up PSG and this was like some deserved win. PSG gave you two goals and then a penalty happened that shouldn't have happened. So let's just put it into perspective. Yeah, sure. Do you know oh, what I'm saying? Let's just put it into perspective. But no, I mean, even putting that to one side. You're allowed to be gassed at a result. No, no, you, no, but don't act like your team's the best ever. It's just like, just be happy you're through. Don't act like it's because your team is greater than everyone. Now people are saying it doesn't matter who they get in the next round, bring it on and on. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa pump the brakes. Pump the no, brakes, like man. Let them be. Yeah. Right, well, fair enough. Yeah, yeah maybe because it <laughs> might bring them pressure yeah, yeah, right down. No, but then uh, when you're in a European competition like this and you, you, you get a result like that, Mm-hmm. You don't care who's the next because you're just enjoying the ride. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't mean that you're like, bring on anyone. No, we're going to win the competition. No, like, that's what no, they no, mean. Bring bro. on anyone. We're that's doing this. That's what they mean. We want to see our team go I, up against yeah, someone else. I genuinely think that's what they mean. I think they are starting to actually believe they're going to win the Champions League. You know what I'm saying? So, well, this, God help you if they do. This Man United team reminds me of when Di Matteo took over at Chelsea. Mm. It's just it's, an aura. It's just, it's like a mirror image. An ex player comes in. Virtually no coaching experience turns it around. It's still in the FA Cup. It's still in the FA Cup. Still in the FA Cup. Still in the Champions League. Di Matteo won the Champions League and And the Olympic FA Cup. And I saw another thing apparently, I think, was it 2007 you guys lost the Champions League final? Yeah, and Man United won it the season after. Uh, you lost to uh, the Europa League final. Uh, Man United won the Europa League the, the season after. Who lost the Champions League final last season? Uh, Don't start putting all that shit. Because <laughs> <laughs> I know you're going to say Please! <laughs> no more! <laughs> Please! Don't start putting all that shit. Uh, Please! Please! No more! Just to touch on PSG because that's where the focus needs to be. I'm sorry. You, there should be a rule. You know, like you said, there should be a rule you're not allowed to take players from a team that use mm. youth academy. There should be a rule you're not allowed back in the league, in the Champions League, ever again, if you spend a billion pounds, have a 2 0 lead, and go up. Mm. PSG, don't waste my fucking time anymore. <laughs> don't waste my time anymore, you losers. No, I'm sorry. You fucking losers. There's no club that needs a European Super League. More than Paris Saint Germain. Mm. Yeah, then the only team that probably won it. Like, that is really dead. But what's the point? They'll probably get smacked up every week. Because no. the Champions League is that level and they're not good no. at it. No. Basically, go ahead. Go ahead. what Devil hits upon is the critical point. And that is why PSG have been suffering. Like, there is no greater lack of parity than in Ligue 1. Yeah. Like, even, even if Bayern yeah, and Universe have won it for many times, you still have to. So struggle to win games, and even when they won, it's by four points, five points, six points, and everything. Bayern Munich, they still have to hustle to win. PSG literally, literally sleepwalk. Like the difference between PSG and Real France is different. So 
So still we've got them, yeah. basically. No, 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 it's even worse. I think it's yeah. 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 I think 20 odd points clear. Yeah. Yeah. So, 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 so basically, like, so to go from that, little sleepwalking games to now a team that knows how to attack. I've always been not defending against. So it's tough. So my only thing about this is, first of all, for Man United, you couldn't still give them credit. For our first goal, that's what strikers do. Lukaku reacted first, and that was a good finish. A great finish. To so, both passes, and because the, the ball was always going, going, going off. So to be able to get the ball, finish it from a very tight angle before it went off, I thought I've got to give him that. Then the second goal, same thing with Ronaldo 2002. He couldn't be there at the same time and react. He was the first to react before all the defenders, and he, 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 he got the ball in. And even for the penalty as well. I'm not taking anything away from Lukaku's finishing, but Buffon, I love him. But take him out the back of the shed like this. No, no, no. Him down now because no, I'm you, can't, him. you can't, you can't make that mistake. Like no, I will take him to the park and leave him there. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 seriously. I respect, <laughs> no, seriously. Perform, I respect what you, you you've done, but down. you're too old. <laughs> Retire. You cannot make it. Like, you cannot make a mistake like that. He, the, the, the guy said he goes to art exhibitions now to keep his mind focused. And I'm not having an attack on Buffon, but bro, that is it. Yeah, someone needs to find out if it's the same one. <laughs> it might, it might have to mention one. It's standing in the loop, like. Have you seen this different? <laughs> and, and we're talking about the best goalkeeper that's ever lived, in my opinion. No. So I'm not discrediting. No, 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 no. no, 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 no I'm agreeing with this. No, 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 no. no. You but have tarnished his reputation. You've tarnished it. It doesn't take it away. It doesn't take it away. No, PSG. You cannot be allowed back in the Champions League anymore. This is stupid, man. Like that one with four zero against Barcelona. That was bad. But you know what? It's still, it's, still, it's still Barcelona, but still, that was bad. 4 0 to lose, that was bad. At least that was Suarez Messi and Neymar. No, that was still, bad. No, 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 no. no. As well. To lose 6 1? 6 1? No, no, I know. No, but, 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 that, but like we've all said, Messi makes miracles happen. Neymar is the second best. So, you know what I mean? So, there's no excuse. Okay, 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 okay. But, but let's, let's combine it. So, you combine that with. Why is it? I think they had 10 first team players Messi. 10. Pogba, their main instigator midfielders. There is no excuse. So how do you still conspire to find a way to still lose? It is one of is it this badge, this club, everything about them is a absolute disgrace. This is the most embarrassing, loserish piece of crap in the world. <laughs> everything I've said, if they allowed back in the Champions League, like I don't know how this players even play play the next game. Like how do you even play the next game? Like for Thomas Tuchel, what do you do next? And so it's not like, crazy it's, as well that a lot of people, but you lot might have even thought about this. How do they attract good players anymore? Money. money. No, no, but that, at least, yeah, but you've got you've got to look at the at the way a lot of those players are reacting now, and they're being paid high, and they're still like thinking, what the fuck is this? Players do kind of have a bit of self pride as well, like you but can get big money. Yeah, so the West Ham going to China. I want to be the first one to do it. It's you know not I mean? gonna happen, bro. Unless they get messy, no one's saving that club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 